Hey guys, welcome back. So today is day three of my Valentine's Day lookbook and the first thing we're gonna take is my Zulu by Juvia's uh, eyeshadow palette and we're gonna take that pink shade and a nice fluffy brush and we're just gonna put that in our crease. We're gonna blend it out as well as pack it because we want that pink to show. In that same palette, I'm going to take that purple and a smaller uh, blending brush and I'm going to pack that in real well right underneath that pink and right into that crease area. Yes, these things are old and crunchy. It's just for a thing. They're still old and crunchy. I can't keep putting dirty lashes on my lip on my face. Right off after you're done. It's only for the video. I need lashes regardless. Now I'm going to take my concealer, put these little dots on my eyes, and look all the way up to the ceiling. And this is this gives me a great outline for where I'm going to cut my crease. In that same eyeshadow palette, I'm gonna go back in with that purple and that same brush that I used. And I'm just going to diffuse that purple in the outer V of my eye, just so we can give my eye look a little bit more depth. Now I'm gonna take that pink rose gold color and I'm just going to take a flat shader brush and pack that onto my lid. With my face now completed, I'm going to take that same purple and a small uh, shader brush and I'm just going to put that right along my lash line. Taking that pink and a small blending brush, I'm going to diffuse the edges of that purple and I'm going to give my under eye a little bit more smoke effect. And if you're like me and you get a little messy, you can always take the damp uh, sponge that you use to blend out your concealer, and you could just use that and tap away the excess eyeshadow that fell. Taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills highlighter palette, I'm gonna be taking the color Forever Young, and I'm gonna put that in the inner corner of my eye as well as highlight my face with it.
my Kat Von D liquid uh, matte lipstick. I got this my freshman year of college about three years ago. Um, I It doesn't even have the name on it anymore, but I wore this puppy to the death, okay? This is like my go-to lip color. Um, <laughs> you can literally leave it like this. I didn't really like it, this vibrant. I thought it was just a little too bold for me, but you could definitely leave your lips like this and this could be your completed look. So I took my ColourPop um, Ultra Satin Lip Nude Lipstick and I tapped that on the middle of my lips so that way I can get a nice ombre effect. So this is my completed look. I'm going to call this look Orchids because every lady deserves to have a nice bouquet of flowers on Valentine's Day. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and don't forget to stay tuned for tomorrow part four of my Valentine's Day lookbook.